You okay? You got your father's power! Gus, <laughs> despite our differences, I've always said you're one of the best trainers in the business. I don't care what you say about me, Queen. Did this old man ever get your father a title shot? He was on his way! The only way to the title is through me! Not if nobody can beat me. Oh, you think so? You don't know who you're fucking with. Dad! You've been listening to this stupid old man! Lucius Palmer likes to run, but he'll get aggressive at the end of each round. He's good at stealing fights. She's right about Palmer. She's a smart girl, that man. And there's the opening bell, round number one, scheduled for four. This one is expected to be a thriller. Palmer's really in position to control things in this fight if he can do what he did just there, and that's land a good, solid jab. Really brought at that time a four-punch combination. Palmer's defense, is it ever good? Look at how easy he's able to block those punches. Is there any advice that you can give in a matchup like this of speed versus speed where maybe one guy can go and utilize a completely different tool, like try to be a power puncher on a given night or do something ultra defensively that could be an advantage? Yeah, misdirection. You know, the guy is going to be real keen, both guys, because they know they have somebody who's so fast in front of them. So start one hand he's going to be looking he's going to react start the right hand just a little flinch of the right hand throw the left hand instead misdirection good block by palmer Locks that belt line well. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work by Andre Bishop. Oh, and he returns fire with a left hand. And he's holding. Palmer's once again the target of a hook. He clearly came in with a strategy here tonight, Teddy, and so many times it's, hey, I'm gonna bang that drum. Yeah, he is banging that drum. That drum happens to be the body, and he figures that he's gonna try to move on him, so start doing it early on, and later on, he's gonna have a guy in front of him. So much anticipation for the pro debut of the young American, Andre Bishop, here tonight facing Lucius Palmer, through one round, Teddy, has anything revealed itself? His hand speed. He's very fast in there. I think he has to settle down a little bit, though, as the rounds go on. Stay away from him. Keep throwing that jab. Don't fight. Just fight. Jab and move. Good action throughout. We'll see if it keeps up in this round of what has been a very even fight. The other day when we were talking to Andre Bishop, he said to have success in this fight, I have to land combinations. He landed a good one there. There's that overhand right. Palmer's lacking that jab there. He just hasn't committed to throwing it at all. I mean, that's the most basic thing in the world is to use that jab. That jab does so many things for you. Keeps the guy defensive, and obviously it sets up your offense. Halfway through this round here. And now just wasting everybody's time holding on. Bishop's doing well here with that two-punch combination. Just an excessive amount of holding here. Just much too much clinching. 
right on the mark with the hook up top. Counter punch up top. Scores up top with a left. You know, Bishop has to be careful at the end of these rounds here as Palmer once again is looking to steal the rounds. Takes one, but gets one. Good work by Andre Bishop. Keep going! Listen, I don't want to see you against the ropes. As soon as you feel ropes, move out. Let's finish this. Keep going. Keep going. We got it. Back to action here at the start of this round, which is Let's just go. part of what has been a very evenly fought fight. One of those fights that's going to be very hard to score. Straight right, left hook, very nicely done, scoring up top. Able to cover up along the belt line, blocks that one. He clinches when he gets to the inside. Palmer's absorbing a hook. Hey, hey, let's go! How about that left hand? That's exactly what he wanted to do, backing him up against the ropes. Keeps his hands up defensively, protecting the head. And he just holds on there. Nice strike after catching one by Palmer. And he's just not engaging in the fight. He clinches again. Good right hand by Andre Bishop. He needs more of that. Solid hook. Nice work. Nice work. Really on the mark with that over-the-top shot with the right hand. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Smart move by Lucius Palmer there, able to block that punch. And this round comes to an end. I need you to keep the pressure up. Keep your hands moving. Don't let this guy rest, all right? Move forward with the jab. Keep pressure. Nice work on the outside. Keep it up. Look, you're standing straight up. Move that body. You need to move that body more. Last round of what has been a highly competitive, virtually dead even fight. Good way to protect the midsection. A piercing jab by Andre Bishop. Palmer's making a mockery of this right now. That guy's not even moving. He's just standing there. Hey, look, you see people quit. You see people give up in different aspects of life. He may be doing that right now. You see him holding on. Pace yourself. Come on, give up. DeAndre Bishop, that training really paid off. Just back to basics with the one-two. Boom, boom. Good combination on the one-two by Andre Bishop. Scored well with the hook. That's a forceful two-punch combo by Andre Bishop. You got it. Scored well upstairs with the right hand. 
final minute of this final round of this fight. Defense easily turns into offense. Blocks a blow, sends an uppercut. Parries it away. Boom, big shot upstairs. something for him himself, and it's a left hand. Don't stay in one spot. Ten seconds to go in this, the final round. Covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. Well, this was a very, very good fight. Close. So that's the official decision. We thank you for joining us tonight. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Good night from...